guys welcome to my channel today what we are doing is just a hot hot pink look with a little bit of pink in our eyes and a little bit of glitter this is kind of a going out makeup tutorial or just you know a night out in the town whatever you're doing I wouldn't really wear this for school or for work I would wear this more for something a little more fancy or for a little more fun makeup look so I wanted to do this for you guys for that just to switch it up a little bit I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you're interested in creating this look well then please just keep watching Hey guys! So to start this look off here, we're going to go in with the Perfect Skin Perfecting Gel, which this is just a primer for the skin and I only place this with places that pores just seem to be a little bit more visible. And then I'm going in with the Buxom Show Some Skin Foundation and just patting that out with my Kabuki brush from Sigma. I will have that link down below if you are interested in it. These are the new Lorac Brow Pencils I am so excited about to use. I'm using the light brown one on my um, the beginning of my eyebrows and then the darker one towards the end. I love these brown pencils, guys. Next, using the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette, I'm going to be using a cream color and just swatching this all over my lid. This is going to help us with blending and making that a lot easier. Then going in with a salty brown color. I should have said sandy, but I think this color is called Salty Caramel. I'm blending this upward into the upper crease area with the E25 brush from Sigma, just really working it into the crease. And then right on top of that, I'm using a little bit darker brown matte color. And with the same brush, I'm just blending that right into the crease area. Then I'm going to pack on this pink color with a little e.l.f. brush. This color really didn't show up how I wanted it to. It kind of looked like a cream color rather than pink, but you know, we just worked with it. Then, of course, I'm going to go back in and blend all of that out. Next, for a highlighter shade, I'm going to use a shimmery light color, and I'm just popping that right onto the brow bone. And as usual, guys, I'm going to wing it out using my NYC liquid liner, but I didn't really create a very thick liquid liner on this look. I kind of just stuck with a medium thickness on this one because I really wanted to go back in and add a little bit more drama. Next, I'm taking a really dark shade, and I'm going to blend this into the outer V and up taking little bit by little bit of color, not adding a lot of shadow at once, and that is how you create this kind of cut crease look, by just taking tiny increments of eyeshadow and working them in. Then going in with my all-time favorite concealer, this is the NARS Radiant Concealer, and of course just blending that out under the eyes, down the nose, a little bit on the forehead area, and a little bit on the cupid bow, just the usual, usual places I highlight. And then I'm going in with this finishing powder. You guys, this is by Hope Girls Cosmetics, and it smells like roses. It is wonderful. Then, of course, I'm going to line my lower lash line with a little bit of dark brown shadow. Then, of course, using the Hope Girl blush. This blush is so pigmented. Look how pink that is on my cheek, and I'm so far away from the camera right now. I was so impressed with it, and it smells good, too. Then I'm going to use my Mary Lou Mattenizer Highlight and just pop that onto the upper cheekbone area to give us a bit of a highlight. You guys, my camera quit filming whenever I bronzed up my face, but I used my Too Faced Bronzer. Next, I'm adding a little bit of black eyeliner and wha-bam, I hit myself in the friggin' face. And this is the Hope Girl Mascara, and this was my first time using it, and I loved it. You guys asked me a lot of questions about the picture I posted about this line, and I love it. So this is the Victoria's Secret um, Glitter Liner, and I just added this right on top of that black liner. This did take a steady hand, but the task was completed. And then to add some more drama to this look, I'm going in with Candy Yum Yum by MAC. Oh, I just love this color. And then on top of that, I'm going to go in with Fiji by Gerard Cosmetics. You guys are coming out with a whole new line of lip glosses. I'm so excited. But I do have a discount code for them, and I do have a discount code for this one, and it will be down in the description. I'm adding in these absolutely gorgeous earrings. They are by the Ford Fashionista. I will have that link down below. I love the jewelry from that site. So this is our final look. What do you guys think? I love this look. It's so dramatic. Big lashes, hot pink lips. Ugh, I just love it. So anyways, I love you guys to death. Thank you for coming to my channel and watching my videos. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.